Rocket blowers are an essential part of every landscape photographer's backpack. I have one and I will tell you guys exactly why you guys should have one in this video. What's up guys, a Project Photography back with the video and today people, today I'm gonna tell you guys why every landscape photographer should have one of these in their backpacks. Now for me, I carry this around everywhere I go. If I'm using even a DSLR or a mirrorless, I absolutely make sure I have one of these in my backpack at all times. What this does, it pretty much just blows air and gets dust out of your sensor. So you don't have to worry about dust whenever you go shoot landscapes or photos or anything pretty much. In 2017, I took a trip to Hawaii in August and I used my D600, which is notorious for having a lot of dust in the sensor because the way the mechanism is made. And sadly, I had that problem during that trip. I was shooting a lot of landscapes, shooting everything at pretty much F8, F11. And when I got home, I noticed all of my photos had dust in it. Now, this is pretty heartbreaking considering that Hawaii is one of my favorite places to go shoot. And now I have dust in my sensor. At the time, I obviously did not know how to use Lightroom and how to get rid of the dust so i really was kind of stuck with this camera that had a bunch of dust in it and i didn't know how to fix it and that made me how to go to my backup camera my canon 70d which was fine but i really wanted to use my d600 at the time but if i had one of these at the time i would not have had a problem with that now dust showing up on your sensor is most prevalent when we're shooting at higher apertures like anything pretty much past f4 so f5.6 8, 11, 16, and so on. So especially for landscape photographers, this item becomes even more essential. Now with the advent of mirrorless cameras and maybe even DSLRs too, but especially mirrorless cameras, it doesn't have the mirror like a DSLR to protect the sensor from the dust and the elements. Now when you're switching out lenses and whatnot, your sensor is even more exposed, allowing for more dust to get in there, which is why a rocket blower to get rid of the dust is even more essential. And especially for someone like me who only uses one body for landscape photography and you switch out lenses all the time between your telephoto and your wide, you want to make sure you get the dust out before you keep switching your lenses because you want to make sure that you don't have those weird dots showing up on your photos and you don't have to worry about that in post. And you might just say, oh, I can just edit it out in post, but in reality, it takes a long time to get rid of the dust. If you have a bunch of little particles everywhere across the frame, it's really hard to get rid of them. And what if it's in places that are crucial, like you can edit them out. So get rid of it right on the spot. You don't have to worry about it in post. And plus these things are super cheap and super lightweight. You can just throw them in your bag. I make sure whenever I go, when if I have a mirrorless or even my Nikon D3S, make sure to have one of these available at all times. So for mirrorless camera owners, for landscape photographers, make sure y'all have a rocket blower in your bag at all times. You can find these on Amazon for like five bucks, really small, really light, get rid of the dust, don't gotta worry about it. And you can go out and take some great photos. So yeah, that's pretty much it for me guys. Let me know if you guys use a rocket blower and if you guys are planning to use the rocket blower after watching this video. Um, this thing is great. Bought this for like three bucks on Amazon. So yeah, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section down below. Comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.